You're not drunk? No, I'm just a little, a little buzz. A little buzz. I'm then a little buzz. Haley knows when I'm drunk. Haley I'm knows when I'm drunk. Haley is drunk. You're a bad girl. They know they're my bartenders. <laughs> Pumpkin latte. And I pray. I pray for single day. For a revolution. What's going on? What the fuck's going on? I don't know. What's up, Pickle Nation? Today. We're taking it to the candy shop, a.k.a. Trader Joe's, where the chicks are always bada bang, bada booming. Goddamn. And if you're there, pick up some motherfucking cheap flowers for your lady, man. Don't be a schmuck. But let's talk about the motherfucking employees for a second. They all look like they're currently in some sad boy band or a motherfucking cover band. Or possibly they were on the Cosby show. Yes, that is Elvin. But we're here to talk about the pickled goods. We got some Manhattan style pickles. We have some dill pickle hummus. We got some spicy sweet things. And fuck Pirate Joe. Let's go. nigga alive welcome back to try the fucking pickle i am your host zo fresh the dillis nigga alive aka the pickle god aka mr figadilla pickle jar poppy and this is the dillis princess of them all Ooh, sure <laughs> <laughs> and today we are talking about pickles from fucking Trader Joe's. One of the best places ever to grocery shop. Seriously is. Yeah. Like, I remember discovering this place from, an, like, an ex-girlfriend who used to go there. Who she still does, I'm sure. Um, and I just, I don't know. Like, that place is, like... They got the coolest stuff. Yeah. They, like... Yeah. Yeah. If you've never gone, you're definitely missing out. Yeah, you're fucking up. Like, literally, you're fucking up. You should really take... The extra 20 minutes, 30 minutes to drive to yeah. your local one. <laughs> and it's not really that local, but whatever. You're going to save a little bit of money, and you're going to get some really good quality shit. Um, personally, some of my favorites over there is the Mushroom Melody. I, get, I, I go there, and I grab all the bags out of the <laughs> thing, and they have to figure out you know, what they're going to do for the next couple days because I buy them all. I'm the guy that buys all of them in Warwick. You're looking at the fucking bandit right here, okay? My friend actually in California just sent me um, one of why are they overdoing it with the pumpkin stuff. Every, she's like up and down, and then she goes to another section, it's all across, yeah. frozen, and she's like, everything is pumpkin right now. Yeah. And I want to go and I want to get all the pumpkin stuff. Oh. Because <laughs> I'm that basic bitch. I just took a DNA test, turns out I'm 100% that bitch. <laughs> Hey, she said it, not me. All right. The other thing I love about them is something that you wouldn't think that you would actually like at a place like this because it's kind of like organic, you know what I mean? It's kind of like on the, you know, the hip, the hipster side of things, you know what I mean? Um, so, fuck. Actually, this is 
a good B-roll, actually. Just record. This motherfucker's really just drying his hands for 30 minutes and fucking up our audio. I just want to eat a fucking pickle. I know. This just is want really, to eat this hummus. This is crazy. It's like ants walking out of a fucking ant hole right now. Look at him. <laughs> this one's on her cell phone, telling her baby daddy about, like, you know, how bad the class is and shit. All right. So, yeah, also there's... There's something there that I, that I didn't think that I would actually find that I like there, because um, I always think of it more of like a like a hipster type shop, a vegan shop, and things like that. Um, the cheese section is out of this oh, fucking yeah. world. The oh, cheese yeah. section at Trader Joe's is crazy. Like if you like cheese, like dank ass cheese, hit that motherfucker up, man. That shit's real. <laughs> um, another thing that I like there is the packaged carne asada. I'm not, I'm not a marinated steak kind of guy. I'm a, I'm a traditionalist. I like a thick-ass steak with just salt. You know what I mean? Fuck the pepper. You know what I mean? That's just how I get down. You know what I mean? But their carne asada and their chicken shawarma and their beef shawarma, it comes in a pack. You take it out. You put it on the fucking grill. Dynamite. All right? I got to try that. It's fucking dynamite. And Priscilla loves the dog treats as well. <laughs> that shit. That's throw up. That's throw up. That's P. Embarrassed. <laughs> of course. But we're here to talk about the pickles. Um, Cheryl did pick these up um, on her quest for greatness of snacks <laughs> at Trader Joe's. She finds them there. I never find anything good snack-wise there. I just go there and get my core shit. You know what I mean? But she always I finds I take about an hour walking up every day, up yeah. and down every aisle. Yeah, yeah. I look real good. <laughs> so what are we starting with today? Let's start with the, what is that, whole kosher, Matt? Yeah, Manhattan so style. These are the Manhattan style whole koshers, all right? Um, they're from Sonoma. I don't think we've had a Manhattan style yet, have we? Eh, we, it's probably a deli style. It's probably like the ones that we love the okay. most, you know what I mean? Yeah, all right. They look like they're holes. Oh, there's a oh, pepper on top. Damn. Are we sharing these peppers? No, that's all you. Are you sure you don't want one? <laughs> I'm sure. All right, I'll just put mine over here. You little wimp. You can have them both. You little wimp. Okay. All right. So, these would definitely bounce off the fucking ground. You don't even got to test that shit. Ooh, they smell good. All right. Yeah, it smells kind of like that New York brine, that deli brine, you know. I'm going to go back to, you know, the right way to eat a pickle. I know some of y'all been trying to wait to come at me and shit, so I'm going back to the, you know, real nigga shit. Hey, yo, what the fuck? What's up, y'all? It's Zoe Fresh, a.k.a. the Pickle God, a.k.a. Mr. Figadilia, a.k.a. the Dillis Nigga Live. All right, so there's some uh, pickle etiquette that we have to discuss. If you're a grown-ass man, you don't go like this. Nah, we don't do that. We don't do that. We don't do that. You get a pickle, you take it, you hold it like this. That's how I'm going to eat it. That's how you do it. Alright. Here we go. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that one's good. Yeah. Yeah, crunch. Super crunch. That's just real. Mm-hmm. That's better than pussy. <laughs> yeah, I know you like pickles, see? Yeah, get it? That's a dick. All right. That's good. Yeah. Garlic. Crunchy. Yep. Let's see what this uh, pepper's all about. Oh. Ew. <laughs> Pepper just messed with them. Yeah. Uh -huh. Um. Now, nah, all the heat's been taken out because of Brian. Oh. But these are really good. We these are really good, good just snacking. Yeah. Good old snacking pickles. Yeah. <laughs> really fresh. Yeah, I'm gonna eat the whole thing. I am too. I ain't letting this go. I've been waiting all day for this guy. Yeah, I'm thing. right. <laughs> oh, this is getting louder. Yeah, I feel like you guys are just gonna 
sit here and listen to our crunch. Yeah. For five minutes. Mmm. <laughs> I feel like we gotta do the hummus next. Alright. Okay. These pickles are A1. I'm gonna take a drink from the Pickle God mug <laughs> by uh, Tyler Mom. Um, if you wanna get one of these made, just hit us up and we'll direct you to Tyler Mom. I don't mind the, the dribble that comes out of my mouth. It, I need to get mine. It's something that I do when I drink anything. I don't know. Mine says shows your girl, though. But I got to bring it so we can have matching mugs. Sure. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Let's get on to these uh, hummus. These little oyster crackers. Now, hummus. Hummus is definitely some hipster shit. Nobody, nobody fucked with hummus until the hipsters came about. Let's just be real here. The hummus was not a real thing. Y'all wasn't talking about no damn chickpeas. None of this shit. <laughs> but now all of a sudden, everyone loves hummus. So this is actually a dill pickle hummus. Can you see that? Yeah. Hopefully. Yeah. All right. Ladies first. This motherfucker's in this goddamn. All right. Let's see what we got. Definitely taste the dill pickle. We get another one. Yeah, I was gonna say I need to try that again because I feel like I kind of liked it. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if I do. Can't tell really. I fucks with it. I fucks with it. You fucks with it. We fucks with it. I feel like it's just weird. I feel like it's like kind of tastes like it's a sour hummus. Like, it's sour, bad sour, because of the pickle. <laughs> yeah. I fucks with it. All right. I want to try it, too. Ew. No? The glove freaked me out. <laughs> <laughs> like you've never licked latex before. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Personally, I, I like it. Um, I'm glad you do. I'll probably eat it still. But yeah, I might just eat it with my finger, though, if you're not going to eat it anymore. I, mean, I don't do think I really need any crackers. All right. The last item we have is, let's see here. This is the sweet and spicy pickled chips and onions. And so onions. we're going to have to eat onions, too. Yeah. That's the thing. I like bread and butters, probably. Yeah, I'm prepared. I'm prepared. <laughs> you know, I got to open up my, uh, my palate. Onion? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to. Yeah, get your onion out of there. Oh, they chop the onions a little bit. They're not like. See, some of them, the companies have like. The balls. The yeah, balls the, the balls, ones. yeah. The, <laughs> the, ball, the ball onions. The balls are the best. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, let's see what we got here. Let's Ready? Experience. All right. Oh. They're spicy. Oh, yes. <coughs> oh. Oh, yeah, they're hot. Oh, yeah. You like those? Oh, yeah, baby. These are sweet, but they're hot. You know, Trader Joe's actually, I don't know why I was sleeping on their heat game, because I bought this uh, that is spicy. ghost pepper chili <laughs> grinder. Now, I only saw it there once, and I have a feeling that it's not on the shelves anymore because someone fucking died. <laughs> that shit is spicy as fuck. I mean, I put it on my eggs and all that shit, and it is out of this world fucking spicy. I'm not even lying. Like, just two little grinds, and that's all you need. You go anything past that, your, your old ring is, is on fire. It'll be the ring of fire, fucking Johnny Cash in the background. <laughs> Mm. I don't even know what's in there that's so hot. It just says dehydrated red pepper, red bell pepper. That ain't that hot. No, there's some ghost pepper in there. Oh, that's that hot. nice. Now this will be good. I need all the crackers now. I got a good glizzy. You know what I mean? A what? A good glizzy. It's a hot dog. We call that in the hood. Oh, what? 
I've you never know. heard that ever. Oh, yeah. I ain't from the hood, though. The, so. Yeah, the glizzy, the glizzy <laughs> goblins are out there. You get caught eating a hot dog in the hood, it's like, you're as good as done. You're as good as done. So you got to, just like how I eat the pickles, you know, sideways. Yeah. You get you get caught with a glizzy going in the mouth. No. No. Real so niggas. Basically shit. anything that's shaped like a dick. Yeah. You Besides popsicles, straight. because you know what I mean? <laughs> you shouldn't be outside eating those anyway. It should be in the confines of your room. Okay. Or no one around. Like you shouldn't be eat, you shouldn't be eating anything that's fallible, you know what I mean, in public. You know what I'm saying? People eat hot dogs all the time in public. I know. They white though. <laughs> <laughs> I love this show because we can we can actually joke about um unpolitically correct things. Yeah, and if you're offended, you know don't saying? fucking watch. Don't fucking watch it. <laughs> Don't fuck, and don't and don't come up to me asking me to calm down my swearing so you can show your kids the fucking show. It ain't for your fucking kids. It ain't for your fucking yeah, kids. Yeah, we thought about it for like a split second. Yeah. It wouldn't work. It wouldn't work. <laughs> no. It wouldn't work. You like hearing me swear. You know you do. Fuck yeah. you. You <laughs> like that. You like that motherfucker. All right. This is another episode of Trader <laughs> Try the Fucking Pickle. This is a Trader Joe's episode. Shout out to Trader Joe's for being an A1 fucking store for our generations you know what i mean i don't feel like this is for the older folks i see older folks there though yeah um but before i feel like this was they were hiring younger people they had good marketing they just didn't give a fuck about no corporate stop and shop bullshit even though they're part of a chain with whole foods wait i have a quick quick story about trader joe's uh so here at mike's famous we do we ring the bell when someone buys a bike clap everybody gets excited <laughs> Well, I was at Trader Joe's one time, and being here for like four years, and they ring the bell, and I'm like, "Woo!" And I'm like, "What's happening?" <laughs> and it was they ring the bell to get like their shipmates or whatever they call them, and I was just like, "Oh my god, I'm fucking embarrassed." <laughs> Speaking of the bell, did you know they got rid of the bells at Big Y? Yeah. That's fucked up. Like, I'm giving the people <laughs> props for getting I me know. in and out, and you guys take away the props? You know why? Because they're sensitive, and some people weren't getting their bell ring. That's why. It wasn't fair. I'd like to ring the bell of the CEO of Big Y. And by that, I mean punch you in your fucking face. That. That's All right, that's it. That's it. Take care. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, dripping juice. Uh. Dripping pickle juice, uh, uh. Dripping juice, uh. Dripping pickle juice, uh, uh. Dripping juice, uh. Dripping pickle juice, uh, uh. uh. Dripping juice, uh. Dripping pickle juice. I got that juice. I got that pickle juice. I got that juice. I got that pickle juice. Step one. Show about the barbecue. Step two. Locate pickle juice. Three. Make sure lid is loose. Step four. Drip, drip it on my shoes. Dripping juice. Dripping pickle juice. Dripping juice. Dripping pickle juice. 